Clear 12 Futurecast. It can feel a little bit of a difference in the air today as the humidity is creeping up on a southerly wind, a wind that's been uh, sustained around 10 to 15 miles an hour. We'll even see a few gusts as high as 20 miles an hour here as the afternoon goes on. This is live city cam, and it's a bright blue sky here at this noontime. Temperatures have climbed into the mid and upper 70s in our inland spots, including Providence and Smithfield now at 77. Newport's a little cooler. Areas along our beaches are in the low 70s with that south wind again at about 13 miles an hour. And the Humidity is still fairly low, but it is going up and it's going to be in that uncomfortable category here for Wednesday and Thursday. It's going to be followed up by a thunderstorm threat. A cold front will approach and while there's not a lot of cool air with that front, it will deliver a risk for some showers and some thunderstorms. Now, I've changed the timing a little bit from what we were thinking yesterday. Not so much Wednesday, but now we're thinking later Wednesday night into Thursday for the risk of seeing those storms. Your Newport Harbor this afternoon at 72 degrees. Good mother. Great day to be out on our local waters. Radar is quiet, and we should stay that way throughout the rest of the day today. So here's where our dew point temperature is going. You can see the trend up to the sticky category, or just right borderline with it at 60 for our dew point right now, up to 67 Wednesday and Thursday, which is up in that uncomfortable range. Why not the view? High pressure sliding east. Warm front is trying to punch through. There are a, a batch of clouds and some showers with this warm front. The showers should dry up before reaching us. But I do think some of this cloud cover will come and pass through here as the afternoon goes on. Our risk of seeing showers again for Wednesday staying off to the west of us with that cold front. But as that front approaches Thursday, we'll have to dodge a shower or a thunderstorm. And our future cast shows all of that, including some of those advancing clouds later this afternoon. So here we are at 2 o'clock. Sky's turning partly sunny for the late afternoon and evening at 11 o'clock at night. Uh, partly cloudy skies to start, but then some low clouds and some fog possible by dawn tomorrow morning. So maybe a little bit of a gray or murky start. That should thin to hazy sunshine and we're dry at three o'clock in the afternoon dry right through the early evening hours and then mostly after 11 12 o'clock at night we'll bring in that chance for some scattered showers in the morning thursday is not a washout there'll be some dry time and even some hazy sun warm and humid or maybe another additional shower or thunderstorm that pops up in the afternoon mostly sunny at our beaches today around 73 degrees this afternoon in our inland spots 81 65 overnight tonight southwest winds at five to ten miles an hour won't be as comfortable to sleep without the air conditioning on tonight and tomorrow will be one of those days where if you have the AC or the fans you're gonna want to have them going 83 warm and humid with a clouds and hazy sunshine unrestricted visibility visibility on Narragansett Bay for today just coming off of our low tide for the day seven day future cast 81 today 83 for tomorrow that shower and thunderstorm threat on Thursday again they'll be scattered hit or miss. Not everyone catches them, but those that do, heavy rain's the biggest concern. Also the potential for some gusty winds and some lightning. Late in the week, the humidity drops back down. It looks fantastic for the upcoming weekend with temperatures seasonable running at about 80 to 82.